So a few weeks ago, I discovered something really cool in Planning Center I didn't even know was possible, and I've been using it ever since. Did you know you could transpose an MP3 in Planning Center? It's pretty cool, and it's really helpful. Let me take these earbuds out because that music is pretty loud for me. <laughs> but it's really helpful to be able to take, let's say you have an MP3 of a song you want to do in one key, but the original isn't in that key and you want to practice with it. Well, now you can do that. You can literally change a song directly in Planning Center. But hey, my name is Evan DiDio. We're going to be talking about transposing music directly in Planning Center. This has very, been very helpful for me, and this is going to be a fairly quick video. So be sure that you like it. Be sure you comment below if you have any questions, because we're going to be going through this kind of quickly. Um, so comment below if you have any questions about all of this, and even like Scott Harvey. Yeah, I had no idea this was possible either. It's really helpful. So let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Hopefully we're going to do more videos on this in the future. So subscribe. And click that bell so that way you get notified whenever I go live because I do this every Saturday and I post videos every single Tuesday to help you, a fellow worship leader or just person at the church trying to help out. But let's go ahead and hop right into it. So let me get my streaming gear in order. Yeah, there we go. All right. So here we are in Planning Center. I'm going to go ahead and click Add a Song. Um, I, I might just choose a random song because... Like, let's just do something that we already have. Let, no, let's not do something we already have. Let's see. Let me just... We, this is something... Oh, I, I have a good idea. Let's see. What's Planning Center's recommendations? View top songs. I'm just going to choose one of these. So, Waymaker. Oh, nice. Build my life. Goodness of God. Let's see. What should we do? Let me know in the comments. What song should we do? What song should we do in this list that you see? I think that we haven't done yet. Like, The Blessing is new. The Blessing's doing pretty good. Uh, we could Maybe we could do The Blessing. I don't know. Good, good father. It's a little repetitive for me. Uh, it's gone down six points, I think. Is, what, is that what that means? But I think we'll just go ahead and go with the blessing. So we're clicking this. Uh, which, which blessing? Which blessing? Let's see here. I'm going to pick Samuel Horner's version of the blessing. So it's in G. Now, this doesn't really matter much. Um, I'm going to go ahead and song select lyrics. I'll go ahead and diselect that and diselect that. We don't need those. Upload or link more files? Yes. So, what I'm going to do is I am going to pick from my already copy written song that you've actually heard. It is this one right here. That funky little beat. So we're going to be transposing that. I, don't, don't worry, I've already worked on all the copyright stuff, so that's already fixed. Um, it's playing in the background right now, too, so I'm going to attach it to the key of G. No, yeah, I'll attach it. So let's say this is in G. I don't know what key it's actually in, but it's uploaded. Boom, here we are. There it is right there. Now I'm going to go ahead and try and refresh. No audio files to transpose. Okay, so this might be a problem that you would run into because this is a WAV file. You cannot do it with WAV files. So I'm going to have to go in through a back route. So um, you might have another, a different kind of thing you can use to change um, from one type of file to another. You can use pretty much every, anything. Terra Didio said, do reckless love. <laughs> um, not this time, not this time. But while that's loading up, there are people are laughing at Terra. <laughs> Um, so you, you can use anything pretty much to change this up. I'm using Adobe Audition just because this is what I use. You can find free stuff out there. M uh, wave files to MP3. It's a converter. That's what you're looking for. So something that converts wave to MP3. That's what you want to look for. And you can look that up on Google or wherever. So we are going to take this and drag it right into here. Boom. I'm going to hit file. I'm going to hit export file. Um, I'll keep it as dub step and I'm gonna have to come down here and it's on wave now but I want to change it to mp3 so I'm gonna click mp3 I'm going to save it into my downloads just because I prefer it to go there blah 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 boom it's done okay so now I'm going to click add files I'm going to come over here gonna click downloads gonna take dub step drag it into here and it's processing attached to, we'll, we'll attach it to key of G, why not? Hit done, and now it's in there. Now you see this little button right here pop up. It says transpose audio. You're going to click on that. We are going to, from G to, let's say we want to change it from G to E. 
Okay, now you have a very crucial step. Now, you probably won't be able to end up hearing um, the audio. Maybe I can fix that in a second. But, in fact, let me go ahead and... No, I'd have to sign back into Planning Center. We'll just we'll just go from here. So, you'll have to choose either up or down. Up or down. So, I it usually sounds better for me to go down. So, I'm just going to stick with down. I'm going to click Transpose right here. And now, that is transposing. And while that's transposing... Let's go ahead and take a quick second and talk about today's sponsor, Evan DiDio. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe and ding that bell to get notified every time I release a new video. I'm also trying to add this as a, um, a URL so that way you'll be able to hear the audio. So just give me a second for that. Number five, yep. Okay, so I figured out all of that. I'm just going to bring download the audio file and it downloads it as a wave. So let's go ahead and play that real fast. So let me play the original track for you real first real fast. So. Here it is, playing in the background. You can hear it. So that is the original file. Let me turn it all the way down. And here's the transposed file. So see? See, it can transpose very easily in here so all you have to do to download it if you want to is hover over it and click that little button and then you have it download but that's it y'all thank you so much for watching i hope that this video helped you learn how to transpose music audio files in planning center it's a really simple easy hack that'll help you practice a lot more and practice is the key to better praise and better worship so get to it i'll see you in the next one this has been evan didio signing off peace